In the grand economic chessboard, India and Pakistan hold untapped potential. Picture this, India accessing Central Asia through Pakistan, raking in an annual $30 billion from transit and fares alone. Or imagine Gwadar, fully operational linking China to the Middle East, yielding annual profits soaring to billions. There's more. By offering visa on arrival for religious pilgrims with a modest $100 fee and a $2,000 exchange condition, we're looking at a potential $2 to $3 billion annual profit from a mere 1 million pilgrims. Envision providing India a corridor to establish Bajaj and Hero Honda motorcycle plants, or Mahindra Motors and several IT groups in Pakistan. We're talking an additional $50 to $70 billion in profit. Through trading with India for vegetables, rice, and other food needs, we save foreign exchange while exporting cement, salt, and surgical instruments. The key to unlock this potential? Putting aside the Nuri Nath. The possibilities are immense. This, friends, is the power of cooperation and shared prosperity.